I have a theory. Today I have a theory. Okay. I got a nice theory. It is a theory, not a fact. I'm going to spread this information. I know you missed me. Welcome back. Welcome back, man. Holy. You know, you get a little comfortable. First of all, I miss you. Welcome back. All right. You know, I, I'm not a superstar yet. I got a theory. Uh, <laughs> Hale. You miss it, didn't you? I miss you too. Come here. Ah! I know. I know. While I was gone, there was a lot of idiots on here. There's a lot of voices that don't need to be heard. Throughout my, you know, YouTubing, if you will, during this time, I'm going to put a name on this show eventually. For now, it's just my YouTube. It's AK doing AK. But it's a lot of people. Throughout my life, I've just seen this a lot. But lately, you know, with the YouTube, they will watch me like a hawk. But too, I don't know if it's stingy. I don't know if it's hate. I don't know what it is. But I can't get a like from you. A like? A comment? Nothing, but they will turn around and blatantly copy me. And my haters got, you know, I've, I've gotten aggressive. So I've got my haters turned aggressive. Like, damn. You know, like. I've got demonetized here and there because it turns out I got a, 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 a I got a, <laughs> you know, you guys should do a, open a nonprofit while you at it because you seem to love working for free and it's like their job became watching my videos and looking for stuff to demonetize me for. That's neither here nor there. I got a theory. I really don't think Kanye West is racist. We all sat there and watched him. Uh, uh, you know, it, would, it looked like him, he was losing his mind. But the whole time, I could not help it think he is not racist. Now... Through my life, I've achieved a certain level of fame. This, what I just said now, me achieving fame, just this alone is going to trigger some people and to come in here and tell me, you're not famous, I never heard of you. What you say does not make it not true. A lot of people are famous and don't have social media. Come to my city and ask about me. I'm known. A lot of people know me, but they rather not help me grow. You know what I mean? Because the competition or whatever the case may be. If you ask a lot of people, my voice is not needed. Sure, okay. But as you will see, If you ask a lot of people, they're going to say, my voice is not needed. I'm full of myself. But I am about to show you why they are false. And I'm also, I don't humiliate no one. I don't like that. But I'm going to put a mirror in your face 
and see if I'm full of myself, what are they full of? Because when I come here and open my mouth, you know, these guys that copy, right? Or the, the guys I've mentioned. I want to start a podcast, a podcast. What are you casting? NPC opinions. Now do you think for yourself. Try it. Try it. Here's the thing, man. Think about it. You and a lot of people want what Kanye West has. His money, his life, yada, yada, yada. Now, uh, how many of you here have went through a breakup? How many of you have been dumped by a female? Okay. Now, no matter how how much of um, you know, guys like to say, I don't care about a girl. I'm I'm gonna give one. Okay. But between me and you is man, bro. It hurts. And imagine this scenario, right? Just to put it in perspective. You broke up, <laughs> first of all, uh, uh, and I don't, you know, call me whatever you want to call me, but I don't find Kim to be that attractive. Maybe when I was younger, maybe the Ray J tape ruined it. I don't know how it didn't ruin it for Kanye. Okay? It is what it is. You know? I only seen her in, 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 in pictures, okay? I've never seen her in real life. But let's pretend here. You had a girl, uh, you know, people rank her high. I, I'm just speaking out of people's opinion. So let's say you had a girlfriend, had, keyword had, and she was on the same hotness or attractiveness rated by you and, you know, let's pretend you. Let's say you had the baddest B, all right? You had her. Ooh, Kim K. All right, not like Kim K. You had the Kim K in your mind. Cool. And, you know, you have everything the world wants. So you're always followed around, um, harassed. Uh, you know, you guys want fame. A lot of people today, since Instagram, a lot of people think they're famous and want fame. You know, you might be a regular person. You want fame. I'll tell you this from experience. You want the things that sound nice in theory. But fame comes with a headache. And remember this point. It's my laptop. Let's pretend you play a video game. All right? When your character is... All right, uh, defeated, let's say, your character is gone, you click another button, and you spawn again. Real life, your character is gone, <laughs> there's no spawn button. In a video game, in a fictional world, or in a story, fictional story, whatever, you can be famous. And fall off. Happens a lot. Um, even if you were famous, like a lot of one hit wonders, for example, you can be famous, fall off, and the media will still antagonize you and bring up your drama if it ever makes it to the media. And at that point, you're a public figure. So once you enter that life, it's hard to not become famous. Now, I understand wanting to stay famous and make money, but there's a when you achieve infamy, when you achieve a level of fame that is on Kanye West, like, um, and he hasn't really been in music a lot. He's been Yeezys and Adidas and Valencia, I don't know. But nonetheless, 
Kanye West, every time he's seen in public, everyone wants to, you know, every TMZ, DVD, whatever, everyone wants to get the next story. And the media is not in the business of making you happy. If all the news was good, you would not be clicking. This is why your Instagram, your news, everything is bad news, bad news. All right? The world is not that bad. I'll speak on a different video. But again, everyone wants to get you caught in 4K on something. All right? Like, remember when they said he was, um, what's his face? Or her face? I don't know. Not James Charles. The other... They said that the, the, the tranny was in Wyoming. Let's say he wanted to sneak in a tranny. The media was outside his door like four in the morning. Bro, who? What? Four in the morning, you outside my house? I don't care what your reasons are. This is unacceptable. Kanye stepped outside and handled it, but most people would have, if it was a white dude, he would have called the cops on you guys. So, moving on, all of that taken in. Now, you have the baddest B. You got the finest girl ever by your standards in your mind, according to you. The finest girl ever, right? Cool. She dumps you, and you are super, super, super duper famous. Now, when I was going through breakups, good terms or bad terms, Usually, you want to move on. I've had the type of friends who'd make jokes and try to tease me, to troll me. I've been a troll, so I expected that comeback, but I always been quick to shut it down. Like, yo, you going to do like her? Uh, hey, man, you better forget her. You better uh, her, 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 her. Stop talking about it. I'm trying to move on. Right? Stop bringing her up, bro. Can I move on? I want to forget about her. I want to forget her and move on. You better find you a new girl. But... Matt, can you shut up about it? I'm, I don't even want a new girl. I just want to forget the old one. Can we do that? Stop bringing it up. All right, bro. I'm sorry. Cool. Thank you, bro. Ale. Let me move on. Now imagine you're Kanye, though, and you didn't just break up with a girlfriend, you divorced. Different levels. You don't only divorce, you got kids in the mix. Ooh. Have you ever seen your girlfriend? Or e even if you, listen, after you break up, there's like two, three months, you seeing her with another man hurts you. Admit it, don't admit it, unless you are C-U-C-K. It hurts. One time I had a B, and she knows who she is. I never forgot about that. I moved on, but I never forgot how you did. That was H-O-E behavior. She, she tried to piss me off after a breakup. It was only like three, four days, and she sent me a Snapchat of her in bed with another man. Holy. Listen. I don't lack no bees in my life. I got women. If I wanted to, I can get any bee I want to. That's what I think like. So I could have leveled up and pissed her off. I could have not even cared. I feel like a black Justin Bieber. All right, you guys listen to dating coaches. You should, if I had a course, you'd, it would be successful. But long story short, it hurt me. And I admit it. It hurt me. And that was just a Snapchat. Back then, Snapchat was, you don't, it wasn't multiple snaps. It was 10 seconds max. So these 10 seconds really hurt me. And she wasn't famous. I, I wasn't big. Man, that devastated me. It took me time to heal up. I'm healed now, I think. 
Now imagine you're Kanye West, though. And every time you look left, Kim is with Pete Davidson, Skeet Davidson. You look right, Skeet and I are going shopping. You look left, Skeet and I are in love. You look left, Skeet is with the kids. The kids! So he can see the kids and I can't? Oh, let me look away. Kanye, you know Kanye's already got anger issues, bruh. You look left, Kanye and Kim. You look right, Skeet Davidson. You look left. So when he made that video, putting him in the ground, a lot of people try to like, he's a bad guy. I'm not saying what he did was a good thing, but bro, come on. What'd you expect? Get this. So you look left, and people can't stop talking about it. You look to the left, Kim and Kanye divorced. What is Kim thinking about? Why did they divorce? The details of their divorce. You look left, Kim said this, Kanye said this. Is it over Trump? Is it about this? What could it have be? The biggest name that she used him. Damn, bruh. Kanye is looking at the TV like this. Shh. Kanye and Kim. Shh. Kanye and Kim. Shh. Kanye West and Donald Trump. Could this be the thing? Oh, le- Shh. Kim and Kanye. Oh, my God. Can someone talk about something else? Shh. Kim, Kim and Kanye. Shh. Shh. Bruh. I am done. Let me go F the TV. Let me go on YouTube. Let me give these kids a chance. Let me go and see my video. 100 million views. Ha, Lee. That's right. Let me check the homepage. I'm bored. Oh, Lee. Podcasters? Everyone talking about it. I, Kanye said, I am done. I'm going to China. Sits in China. Did it hit the hotel? Ah. <sighs> No Kim, no Kanye, I'm dead. I'm all Kanye, Tim. Even in China? Bro, that's what comes with the level of fame that he achieved. She was a random bee? Okay, but you made her the star she is. Now you got to sit there and take it. And every news headline media will treat you the worst. No one is going to say, oh, poor Kanye. And the rants I've seen on social media, I've been a grieving man before. And I've seen grieving men before. A lot of things that help you while you're grieving is a good circle of love, real genuine love, conditional, not love. Someone who wants to see you win. I'm going to tell you something about me and my life, and this relates to this. When I got verified on Instagram, which was something I invested a lot of money into. I've been going on PR runs for a while. And when it came, the day it came, I was grieving the passing of a very close friend of mine, um, a younger dude. It wasn't natural causes. It was senseless violence. And the people that I thought were closest to me who are not family at least. They were full of envy. People I fed when I had nothing to eat. I didn't want anything back from you. But they were more worried about stabbing me in the back and using me for what they can use me for and spreading lies on my name. But I couldn't even get a pat on the back 
I was losing my mind on social media. I could have got deleted many times, but I wasn't Kanye famous. That blue check was just a pixel on the screen, but in a lot of people's eyes, it dehumanized me. It took the mercy and compassion, the basic level of mercy and compassion is for anybody. It took it out of their hearts for me. A lot of people, I sit there and watch them wish that Jeff Bezos or Elon passes away. As if these people are not human. As if there wasn't times where people told me get a job. I got a job. And I could barely pay rent. I had to live in, in, in horrible conditions and save up to be able to do such investments to get me to where I'm at. And I'm not even up there. And instead of my friends supporting me, they put knives in my back. The bigger I got, the lonelier I got. Very rare to find someone who genuinely wants to see you win at least in your immediate circle. A fan overseas, thousands of miles might want to see you win. Someone on the internet, stranger, he might. But unfortunately, due to you and this, this fame and the circle of trust and paranoia, and, uh, you won't meet that person or get to hang with him. Maybe one day. But it doesn't happen often. The only person Kanye had was his mother and father. He was very close with his mother. God bless his soul, Danda. And it was clear he was grieving her a lot of times. He was going through a divorce and had no one to give him a hug or a pat on the back. His so-called, they call him handler or whatever, his therapist, the person who's supposed to make you feel better, was threatening to put him on zombie mode. Ale. Online, a lot of people cared. A lot of people pretended to care and rode his wave. So he loved it. Then he got took off the media, social media. I'll tell you like this. I hope a lot of you make a lot of money. Most people that watch me already do. I see it. If you don't, I hope you do. And when you do, if you're already there, you know this, you're going to reach a level where it's like, okay, you can make money. You can make more and more, and it feels good. But that dopamine rush has a, it's like a honeymoon, honeymoon stage. When it fades away, like money doesn't make you happy. It gives you that, woo, oh yeah, I'm happy I did it. Then you're going to spend it and make more and spend it. Like if money is what makes you happy, no amount will be enough. And he had billions. But he couldn't see his kid. <clears throat> he didn't have a shoulder to cry on. He couldn't turn left or right <clears throat> without someone mentioning his, 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 his tragedies and with no care to him. And to add to all of this, his, his business, the only thing he had passionate about at the time uh, 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 was his clothing ventures. Then he gets cheated out. He probably got cheated before too. He was grieving Virgil and his mother. No pats on the back, just FUs and, and let me use. Just like what happened to me. Made me depressed for a long time, but... I got over it, and I healed and learned and moved on. And that's on a way smaller scale. I can't imagine Kanye. I get this. Kanye reached the level, like I said. And you might say, Kanye's going broke. You're broke. He's not. If he lost 80% of what he has, he still have more than you. And what's his reasons to stay rich and make more money now? He's like, 
There's people living good with a hundred K. You never heard of them, but they live good lives. Equally on Kanye, they have cars, they have boom, boom. They do it all. Right or wrong? So, I feel like Kanye looked at himself in the mirror and said, you know what? I made all this money. And I can keep making more and put myself in more pain and tragedy, that and which money's not going to fix. And it's not like I'm going broke. I got enough, right? So, he decided to... Remember how I said you can't just click... You can become infamous, famous, but there is no button to click to make you not famous when when you don't want it. But Kanye figured out that button. Maybe he is a genius. He created the button. He used cancel culture to exit. He exited. Does he really feel what he feel about Jewish people? I doubt it. I doubt it. Kanye, I don't know if you're stupid. I mean, people are stupid because Kanye mentally is not racist. As a minority, you can't be racist, but like, what is a Jewish people? <laughs> Can you be mad at Christian people? They, they come in all colors, different shapes and sizes. You think he don't have Jewish fans that made him who he is? Does he hate Jewish people? He's like, no, no Jewish people allowed him. Nah. He might feel some way about the Zionist and, and, and politics, sure. But what makes a man, because well, the first time he said it, maybe he's angry. Defcon? Defcon 3? Maybe I've been too busy working, because I haven't heard of that game, bro. Okay, 3? I never heard of 1 or 2. Defcon 3. Hmm? Oh, the... That he said Defcon, Def Jam or whatever, Defcon 2. Remember that? I did a video. I was confused, but I get it. Now I understand why he said what he said. Because he didn't stop, he doubled down. When you make mistakes, oh man, what was I saying? Let me fix my money up and apologize. PR! Public. But no, he said. Hitler was a great scientist. Hitler. By the way, some of what he said was true. But the way he was coming wasn't like, oh, I apologize, but hear me out. No, it was like, yeah, what you gonna do, buddy? Cancel me, cancel me. And he wore the black mask. That is symbolism. Kanye West is the type of man who once upon a time told Kim to wear something. To dress up a certain way and walk down to trigger a media, which it did. It worked perfectly. Manipulating people into getting what he wants, but not people, media, and news. Done it before, talked about doing it. He's great at it, better than politicians. <laughs> you think him, you think he didn't want to exit? You think he didn't have enough of. A 10-second Snapchat of my, my ex way in the past. Not my wife, my ex. Who I don't got to see every time I want to see my kids, which I can't. It makes it difficult. So that much hatred is way less than what I have for that stupid B. But 10 seconds made me go crazy. Imagine you look in the news every day and the headline is, me and, and Skeet are getting it on by the fireplace over, and it's a Jewish tradition. What? I 
I'd go crazy too. If you go to China to escape it and Chinese people are talking about it, it's like, come on, bro. Like at this point, I'm done with the fame. I don't want it. But you can't exit. Ha <laughs> ha. Yes, I can. He goes on that and he wears the, this. You seen it? And he goes where? Oh no, what's his face? The frogs are gay guy. What's his face? Alex Jones. What makes a man go on Pierce, Pierce, uh, the British dude, to not apologize, only to double down? If he did not fully intend to exit. But AK, that could just be, hold on. Notice how he went missing right after. Remember? This was all his plan. He was done from the me, And he went missing. And what did he find? He's broke. He's unhappy. No, he's not. He's away from the harassment. No one is talking about him and Kim. That creepy guy that be with the handler. I don't know what <laughs> handlers. What are you handling? I'll, uh, I'll give you something to handle. That creepy zombie putting uh, uh, Frankenstein doctor is not around him. And he found if Kim was worried about you, like the girl that the architect, like him and Kim, it was a uh, it was more lust. Maybe it was love, but it was more less than love. And she used him and dumped him. She dumped him when she didn't need him anymore. But the architect did her job and sticked to doing her job. Whether he's with Kim or Bim. And she did her job well. She took her paycheck and went home. Lived the life. And they actually were friends and, and, and co-workers and just worked side by side and probably shared the humor here and there. But it was more natural. It wasn't more like, oh, you're the one with Ray Day. Let me see what that's like. It was natural. Like a real person falling in love. He didn't go missing. He went to get away from y'all and found the one thing that money can't buy. He found the shoulder to cry on. He found real, genuine, peaceful bliss and love. You know how hard that is to find? The bigger you get, the richer you get. Who, how many of y'all? Maybe you do. I wish bad on Elon. Because you're broke. But what one thing you don't, maybe you have a good relationship with your father. Have you ever heard about Elon and his father? I've had a very rough childhood. And then I got to sit around and watch people who had it way better than me. Sit there and complain and compare themselves to me. And try to tear me down out of jealousy and envy. No... When I was grieving, I didn't get a pat on the back from people who used to, maybe they really love me, but not anymore because now I don't deserve love. I don't even deserve a pat. You're good. You don't need it. You got money. This rap ish, it's a lot of fake it till you make it. I'm honest with you. I've had to fake it a lot of times, but I'm not rich. And people felt, I told you, I'm, I'm faking it. And you come and rob me, 1500 is a lot of money. To Zoe, your own best friend for. And it hurts coming from a best friend. You hear me, Momo? While I was grieving, I couldn't get a pat on the back. I couldn't get a share or a like for support from you as a friend. But you put that knife on my back at a time of grief. I lost so much. It happened over and over, not just from dude. It hurt me. 
and I feel for Kanye. And now I understand why Kanye exited. I'm here to tell you, I don't think Kanye believes what he said. He just said it to get you to leave him alone and not talk about him. And it worked. He got enough money to live happy. He don't need to get more money. His kids are rich. Kim is rich. That's my theory. Have some mercy on people. Allah said, if you don't have mercy on my people, you don't deserve mercy from me. Or if you don't have mercy on your fellow people, you don't deserve Allah's mercy. If you believe or don't, I don't give a F, but karma or the universe, or even if religion is not your cup of tea, maybe you like to do drugs because most people who don't believe in religion do. And if you had a trip on LSD or shrooms, you've seen the connection and you understand there's some level of souls and spirits. So you get it. I'm not religious myself, but I am spiritual. Think about it. I wish that man well. And I don't agree with anything he said. In fact, I have a two. I'll, I'll save that for another episode. I have a Jewish friend. Hit like, smash, subscribe. It's your boy AK. Um, you agree? You don't? Let me know in the comments below. I respond, I read. And uh, if you keep playing and copying me and, and just trying to use me and hate on me, you're going to end up like this. This belongs to someone who is hating on me. Oh, actually, their girlfriend. Yeah, great. You read I'm talking. Hit <laughs> like, smash, subscribe, man. Best things in life are free. That's what Joker Stash said when he ran up a B billion dollars. And he wasn't happy. The key to happiness ain't money, it's gratitude. Be thankful for what you have. If you're able to watch this, you have a phone, a roof over your head. You're doing better than a lot of people I know. You're not a starving kid in Africa as far as I'm concerned. We gotta worry about war torn. I don't wanna talk about it. Lose my monetization. I'm from Sudan. I'm not losing my monetization and ending up back a starving kid with this kid. <laughs> it likes that subscribe. Love you, bye.